ring in charge of the action from Malaysia, Bin Amzan Maslam. And for Nestle Patesha, this is her chance for revenge. She lost the gold medal to me in 2013 in the Southeast Asian Games. She's waited six years for revenge. Now is her moment. Now is her time. Lueni O of very own Nesti Petesho in the blue. Nesti. There's a quick combination there for Patesha. Good that she's the one dictating the tempo here in the first round. She's a stalker. She's coming close to her opponent. Oh, big looking right. Looking to land. Big moment. She had her moment in the World Championships, but now Asian Games, she has never won a gold. Oh, look at the precision from Nesti Petesha right now. Just connecting at will. No. Faster, and it appears she's stronger right now and more shifty. And Petesho continues to stalk. Petesho now going orthodox. And you can clearly aware of the power and the speed of Nest who is taking charge here in the first round. And this is a very Ooh. from the Petesho whom Ni beat in 2013. In that first round, a good beginning for the Philippines. Nesti Petesho to open this women's featherweight match here. Great balance also from Petesho. And what you like also about Petesho is that her shots are very clean. Now whether you're all the way at the back of the auditorium, you will see her punches. See the punches. The second down. Second. Second. They're telling Lueni O to not forget defense there. And now going southpaw once more. Now going orthodox. Myanmar fighter just can't solve the defense. Oh, big right again. Oh, See that quick right by Petesho. Oh, body blow by Petesho there. But you get the feeling that. Nessie Petesha is looking for the home run. She's throwing power shots. Oh, big right once again by Petesha. Look at the swarm. How you can see that she's a clearly superior fighter. But she's staying off. I think she wants. Oh, big. Now going southpaw once more. Combination from the Filipina. Body blow this time. Oh, look at the combination. She's making it rain right now. She is a lot stronger. And also a lot more polished. And look at the way she's fighting again. Like a weight division. Ball. Nesti Petesho just running roughshod over Nguenio of Myanmar. And just too strong for uh, the Myanmar fighter. Just too much far power. On the part of Patesha. Oh, can do something more. I think that's a very important Second advice here. What kind of Papa Ipit? Which means don't get yourself trapped near the ropes or near the corner. Third and one round. Three minutes away from claiming a gold medal is Nessie Patesha. And if Petesho wins this fight, the Philippines will clinch the overall championship in boxing in the Southeast Asian Games. And by all indications, it looks like Nesti Petesho will, barring any unforeseen events like a knockout. 
from Myanmar's Nguyen Oh. Oh, look at those connections by Petesho. That's one punch after the other in rapid fire succession. The precision, the speed, and the power all siding with the Filipina Nesti Petesho right now. Well, she's looking very sharp. And the Myanmar fighter has thrown very little in this fight. She's not letting her hands go. I think too much respect here for Nancy Patesho. That's right. Even if in 2013, the same fighter from Myanmar beat Patesho in the final. Oh, great body blow there. That was advice from her coach from that last timeout. Take the body with the left and a right on the head. Nice head movement on the part of Nesli Patesho. Less than a minute to go. I don't think Wenny O can make any major... She's exhausted. She's Her wasting time. Yeah, she's wasting time. She's going to the canvas and... Look at, look at her face. Yeah, she knew it's it. It's the face of dejection. She knew it. And the Philippines is going to win this fight. Another gold medal in the bag. And this will also clinch the overall boxing championship for the Philippines. Games. This will be the sixth gold medal for the Philippines. Nesti Petesho banking on all the experience from the world championships. And of course, that six-year wait to get a crack once again at 20 After three rounds of exciting women's featherweight fight, we go to our judges scorecards, and your winner receiving a gold medal in the women's featherweight division. Winner by a unanimous decision from the blue corner. And there it is, Alpine. it's official. Nesty Petesho has won. Her first ever gold medal in the Southeast Asian Games. And the jinx has finally been broken. That's right. Three silver medals in the Southeast Asian Games for Nessi. And now, a first ever gold medal. And what a shutout that was. Oh boy, look at the score. 5-0. Nguyen Inu absolutely had nothing to show. Philippines has now taken over. And clinched the overall boxing championships in the Southeast Asian Games. And Six what I like medals. about that more is she knew which camera to look at yeah. right after she was announced the winner. Nesti Patesho acknowledging the crowd Nesti. here, her fans, Nesti. her supporters, her family, and of course everybody who gave her that inspirational push to win the gold medal here in the women's featherweight category. So final result, gold medal goes to the Philippines, Nesti Patesho. This time with a gold medal. In the 57 Asian kilogram champion category. From the 57 kilogram, the reigning the world ring. champion. From the Philippines, Nasty Patasio. Now, I don't know if this can top that world championship belt that he has, but if you win a gold medal in front of your very own countrymen in your home country, that has got to be a lot sweeter. That's a special feeling. Oh, yes. Mr. Ricky Vargas with a handshake, the warm embrace, <laughs> and the smile. Congratulations to Nancy Petesho.